Welcome back everybody to episode 9 of this Let's Play series of Creeks, a 2D puzzle platformer that is all hand drawn and is very cool. So we are currently in a room filled with goats. Um, I don't remember... Oh, 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 oh yeah, right, they kill me. Whoops. Take two. Okay, if we go over here, we can hit this button. But I can't make them stay. I can't make it stay open. Oh, okay. Um, I guess I have to go down here. Hit this switch. Okay. But now... Oh, but he goes back. Oh. Can I scare him away? Oh, okay. Well, what does this get for me? I think I need this goat to be on that button and I lock him in there. I think I messed up. Okay, so let's scare this goat over here, and we'll trap him in here so he leaves that door open. I assume he won't leave the button now because there's nowhere for him to go. Oh, he will. He will leave the button. That's weird. What in the world? Oh, I see what to do. Raise this up. Go over here. Close this, scare the goat, let the goat go back to the grass, and then we'll scare him up to the top. Okay, scare the goat, he'll jump up top, and he'll go eat this grass. Well, now what do I do? Do I let him go this way, or will he drop down? Okay, he'll stay, he'll go over here. How do I, um... Well, now what will he do? Okay. So he's gonna go across and eat this grass. Oh, I gotta use this ladder over here. Okay. So I'll scare the goat this way. Okay, now I'm gonna scare the goat over here. Hit this button, and then I scare this goat down. Okay, now I have two goats. I want one goat over there, and one goat over here. Oh no, I want two goats over there. Oh, they make such a cool sound when they walk. All right, oh, look at them. <laughs> okay, so now we have a goat up and down. So now we want like we need one goat below oh we need two goats below i just need one i need how many goats do I need below? All three, maybe? So they fill up all the spaces and I can close them in there. All right, get out of here, goats. Okay, there we go. That was a neat puzzle. feel bad leaving them, but they're also not real. Oh.
Oh my god. He just scratches his head like, ooh. Well, here's that weird car. Oh, I've been over here before. Okay, we've got a goat. Can I go across this way? Nope. Hello, goat. Oh, a dog on a wheel. We've encountered these before, but I don't think we've had to use them for a puzzle yet. This is like an alchemy lab, plus there's all these little cool drawers in here. It's a locked cabinet. Oh, it's a door to the ladder. So the goal is to get to the ladder down below and leave. But I can't get down there yet because I'll just die if I get any closer to the goat. Yeah, exactly like that. Great. Is there one of those devices I can operate? No. Hmm. So what is this dog on a wheel going to do for me? Oh. But if I try to go back up, he'll stop running. I see. So how does this, um, how does this goat help me, I guess is the question. Honestly, not sure. What happens if the goat goes over here? Oh. Oh, the dog. The dog doesn't like the goat. Interesting. Oops, I'm messing up and hitting the wrong one. Why'd he stop running? Oops, 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 I went too early. Oh, I see what to do. I push him outside the light. And then he's trapped between the light and the dog. And will run... The dog will try to run after the goat constantly. So do like this. There we go. See, now the dog is going to try to get that goat. Cool. Made it. Jump across this gap. Interactive painting thing. Okay, he's fishing by listening for the fish. Oh, he's listening to various pools at once, trying to find where the fish are, I guess. Like a colonial era British bird. Alright, up top we have. Hey! It, um, it's that guy! Oh, the book! Did he fall asleep there, not realizing the book was that close? Uh-oh. Come on. Nice!
Yes. Interesting. Well, I guess we'll just move on. Hopefully that book helps. There's like agates and gems and stuff in the walls and the floor here. Pretty neat. Very dark and spooky down here. What do we have here? A, a lever. What the heck did that do? Should I go up and check? Anything change up here? Oh, there's a ladder that wasn't here before. Aha, secret painting. Oh, here's our fisherman bird guy again. It's using a dowsing rod to hold a rock over the water. These birds have a confusing past. What in the world? There was nothing to interact with on that one. We just watched him fail to fish. Okay, what do we have here? Dressers. Double... Oh, they've nailed boards over the dressers so they stay together. What is... The, what are these little diagrams? Look here. Two dressers nailed together become... A bigger monster? Is that correct? The drawers become individual monsters. If you add one dresser, I don't know what this is saying. I hope we don't find out. Uh oh. Oh, okay. He's... Cool. So there's gemstones and stuff. What did I? What did I do? What's this button do? Okay. So we got to get somebody to this button. Oh. Hmm. So do I want to approach this goat from the left or the right? Hmm. Let's try this way first. Oh no, he doesn't want to go up that way. So we'll drop down here. So do we want him to be on this button? Well, wait. <laughs> Just trap myself here. Okay. So I want to scare the goat over onto that button, don't I? get to that um how do I even get up there to that ladder oh I need this goat to be an object so I can stand upon it maybe Okay, what if we do... Oh, I see. Now I gotta let him go. Okay, what if I do this so the goat can't jump? What will he do? Oh, come down here. Okay, this is progress. I, I probably... Um... Oh, yeah, because I need the goats to be standing on both buttons at the same time. Right. 
So I need these goats to go stand in the light. All right, move them like so. And then if I turn the lights off at the same time, we need... How can I make them step on the light at the on the buttons at the same time? Okay, all I had to do was apparently put them on the edges of this light and then just turn it off standing in between them and they both ran and hit the buttons at the same time. So I don't know how I was not doing that before, but I finally got it. Um, so that was a little rough. <laughs> My bad. The music's really cool. Oh, painting. So we'll do this painting and I think that'll be the end of this episode. Oh, this is an interactive one. Okay. Oh, oh. Oh, I see. Okay, I'm trying to go through these hoops. Okay, he likes that. Okay, and this, oh, he wants me to jump out of the water. Okay, I gotta go down, and then... <laughs> Okay, let's try again. All right, go, 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 go. Ah! Okay, now he wants me to go back the other way. He didn't, that wasn't it? Okay, there we go, I like that. Okay, now he wants me to go into the hoop and out and then back. Okay, oh, okay. Now he wants me to go from one hoop into the other. Okay. Oops. A little bit too much momentum there. All right. What next? Okay, bonk the ball into the hoop. Oh, okay, well, that apparently worked. Got the swimmer's achievement. Oh! <laughs> oh, his best friend, this little fish. These are fun. All right, let's just go take a look and see what's coming up next in the one in the episode there. Might be a cutscene. We must be getting pretty far down in the house because uh, there's a... F oh, yeah, there's the water. So we're about at the end, maybe. Oh, we've got a cutscene of some kind. Um, yeah, let's, let's go. There's nowhere for me to go. Elevator, please. Thank you. No! Come on! dead.
Wait. Get, okay. I'll just go by myself. Alright, well. What a way to end an episode, huh? Well, thank you everybody for watching. Join me in the next episode and we'll see if we can do anything about that guy getting captured. Hopefully he's not dead. This next area looks pretty interesting. Lots of plants. Maybe we can bring them back to life with some light or something. Uh, hopefully we can find those other bird creatures and see if there's something we can do about that monster. So, again, thanks for joining and I will see everybody in the next episode.